Today I'm going to show you how to make a perfect paralyzer. Kimura, because Kahlua has less alcohol content. Where's the alcohol content? Oh, it's up here now. This is 20% uh, alcohol per volume. Kahlua, they changed. It's now 16%. They're ripping you off. Get Kimura. So you got to measure very carefully. We call it the, the five count. Thousand one, thousand two, thousand three, thousand four, thousand five. Tequila, Salsa Gold, the best tequila. Uh, this one doesn't have a a, sporing, a pouring spout that uh, allows you to measure it as precisely. So you have to do a four count, but you have to pour a little bit more carefully. This one does have the spout. This is the Winnipeg's premium vodka. Nothing but the best for my family. This one does have the proper spout there so we can tip it as much as we want. Thousand one, thousand two, thousand three, thousand four. Now we need some ice in there. Don't worry people, the, the alcohol will sterilize the ice. Now you need some coke, don't go for that, uh, that other stuff that's a cola product as well. And don't use no name, if you're going to use something else use the other stuff. Oh, it's also better if you have flat coke. I've shaken this stuff up a little bit. You want it flat so it doesn't fizz up. And it's good if you let that sit for a little bit because uh, it'll cool the, the, the drinks. Uh, even better if you keep your alcohol in the freezer, it looks even better for presentation and everything. And then you carefully pour the milk in. You get that nice pattern. Oh yeah. Sweet. Now of course you're supposed to mix it before you drink it. But you know if you're trying to get your woman into bed a little quicker, you won't warn her about that. Okay, that's it. Talk to you later. Okay, I was reminded that I forgot the cherries, so I don't carry umbrellas, so what we do here at our house is use a straw. And you don't just get one cherry at this house, you get as many as I can fit on there. And so you're going to need to buy cherries, and so you need lots and lots of cherries. Okay, that's it for real this time. No, not a crime scene. This is where the cherries were opened. <laughs> 